In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good people, today we are in day three, day three in our novena for candidates and school going children. This day three is also day three for our class eight exams, and it is their final day. For those who are day scholars, today they will finish and go home. For the boarders, they will go home tomorrow morning. So we will be, uh, for the boarders tomorrow morning, we will be wishing you uh, janemasis. To our sons and daughters in class 8, please know that we are praying for you as you sit for your final papers today. For our form 4s, today it is day 9. Uh, this is, these are the papers for today. Uh, between 8 and 10 a.m., first session, it, there'll be a French, listening and comprehension, dictation and creative writing. That is session 1, 8 to 10. 8 to 10.30, first session, the same. Uh, French, listening, comprehension, dictation and creative writing, Braille. That now I understand. Uh, 8 to 10 a.m., first session, German, uh, listening and comprehension and composition. 8 to 10.30, Arabic, uh, grammar, comprehension and composition. 8 to 10.30, Arabic, grammar, comprehension and composition, large print. 10 to 10, 10, 8 to 10 to 10, Kenyan Sign Language, Receptive Skills. Uh, the other paper from 8 to 10.30 is Music. 10 to 10.30, the other paper is Music, Large Print. Uh, again, 8 to 11, Music, Braille. 11 to 11.30, there'll be a break. After the break, 10.30 to 1.45, French. Reading, comprehension, grammar, and functional writing. 11.30 to 1.45, second session. French. Reading, comprehension, grammar, and functional writing. Large print. 11.30 to 2.15, second session. French. Reading, comprehension, grammar, and functional writing, Braille. 11.30 to 2, uh, um, German. 11.30 to 2, German. Uh, that is uh, large print. We also have 11.30 to 12.20, 12 Arabic. Uh, 11.30 to 1, Kenyan Sign Language, uh, language use. And the final paper of Today is, uh, is um, music uh, auro, that is a bit the second session, 11.30 to 12.30. Those are the papers of today. I, I will be doing this every day because I want, as we pray, that we also pray for specific papers. You will also notice that uh, our novena has taken care of specific subjects. They may not be all of them. But specific subjects have been factored in. Now, as we do that, day three, we are focusing on our children's safety. As they sit for the exams, for those that are still continuing, we also pray for their safety. For those who will be going home, we pray for their safety. We know that uh, accidents do happen. So today we are praying that as our children go to school to sit for their exams, as they continue to stay in school to, to write their exams, especially the Form 4s who will be with us until the 1st of April, we are praying for their safety. For the children who closed, who are at home for holiday, we are also praying for their safety. Remember this novena is not only for candidates. We are also remembering our sons and daughters who are at home for Easter holidays. 
We also know that even when they are with their parents, anything can happen. And as I said, accidents do happen. There is nobody who prepares for an accident. There is nowhere that accidents are assured that at this time, an accident will happen. That is why we have a duty and a responsibility to always pray for the safety of our children. Yesterday, when we were praying for our teachers, we also forgot that we need also to pray for their safety. But that's for yesterday. But today, remember, even when you have your kids with you, something can happen. I normally tell parents, that uh, our children do not misbehave because the parents are not there. Even in school, they do not misbehave because the teachers are indifferent. Our kids can misbehave even in the presence of the worshipful eye of mom and dad. Our kids can misbehave even in the worshipful eyes of their teachers. It is as simple as that. That is why we need to take time to pray for the safety of our children. Remember, the only person who can take care of our kids in a very special way, it is our God. We will do our part. The government, and we want to thank the government. I don't know whether we have a day that we are praying for the government. The government has provided security officers. But again, remember, our security officers also need security. That is how frustrating it can be. And that is why we say, ultimately, the only person who can protect us is our God. The only person who can protect our kids, it is our God. So we appeal to him today that he may protect our candidates as they write their exams. That he may protect our sons and daughters, those who are at home for holidays, that as they go about their daily activities, they are protected. That marks the end of day three. To our class eight sons and daughters, may God bless you. Keep writing that which you have been taught. We believe and we know that you will succeed. May God be with you. Our form fours, we are with you. You may not see some of us, but constantly you are in our hearts. We are praying for you. We are holding you like that in our hearts. In our prayers, we are doing that. And we shall do it until the last day. And the last day is the 1st of April. How I wish that we can all... Uh, hold tenaciously to the fact that all of us need to pray for our young ones. Let us keep this fire burning, the fire of this novena. May God be with each one of us as we stand in the gap for our kids. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, do have a productive Wednesday.